Welcome to IntelliTest Manager, a flexible online portal that gives you access to new offerings, information, and test updates from Athena Diagnostics. This interactive demo of IntelliTest Manager will provide you with an overview of the application. To start, go to athena.intellitestmanager.com, enter your client number, and associated zip code. International customers leave the zip code field blank. Then click Login. From the IntelliTest Manager homepage, you can access the following sections. Lab Updates. Test update information is available in a variety of formats, and you can view, export, print, filter by account utilization, and customize the information to fit your needs. What's new? Learn about new test offerings from Athena Diagnostics. Support. Information on how to utilize IntelliTest Manager effectively and who to contact for assistance. My Account. Manage your account information and email notifications. These tabs remain accessible regardless of the page or section you are currently viewing. On the upper left-hand side is a breadcrumb trail of the pages that you have viewed. You can return to any previous page on the trail by clicking on it. Communications. The Lab Updates page lists all types of lab communications received within the past rolling 12 months. These communication types include monthly update, immediate action, new release, special announcement, client specific, or test send out. These communications are sorted by the announcement date and title located in the first column. The most recent updates are listed first. The second column lists the communication type. Any time that you see these green arrows in the application, it indicates that you can resort the list you are viewing by clicking the column header. The third column displays an icon if an alert is associated with the communication. Hover your cursor over the yellow triangle icon to view the message. One type of alert is a revision message, indicating when there has been a change in the communication. The pop-up text will provide you with an overview of the change. The fourth column displays icons used to print or export the entire communication. You may tailor what information is included in the printout or exported file in the Customize Your View section, which we will cover shortly. Your options are to view the communication as a PDF or Excel file, or click on the last icon to select your vendor-specific product and export an Excel file that is in the format specified by your EMR or LIS vendor. This may facilitate the loading of test updates into your system. The last column allows you to select a checkbox indicating that you have viewed the communication. This can be used to assist you with managing your actions for each communication. If you have checked the box that you have viewed the communication, the box will automatically be unchecked if a revision to the communication is published. This is done in an effort to assist you in quickly identifying what you should review when you log in. specific communications. Click search to expand this section and display the options available to search for specific communications. You may search for items that fall within a particular date range. For instance, if preparing for upcoming changes, you might want to search by the effective date to know what will take place within the next week or month. Or if returning to work, you could search by the communication date to locate what you missed while you were out. After your search results display, you are presented with the option to filter these results by your account utilization. When doing so, the system will only display communications related to tests that have been ordered by your account within the last 12 months. To filter by additional account numbers, type them into the account number field separated by commas. You may use the other search fields in conjunction with a date range or without one. For instance, if you're interested in viewing all communications of a particular type that fall into this date range, select the type here and click Search. Or if you want to locate a communication regarding a particular test, you can clear all of the other fields, then type only the test code or test name in this field and click Search. If you utilize an interface, you can select the Show Interface Mapping checkbox 
to include interface mapping information such as result codes and result names when viewing, printing, or exporting information. Specific communications. While on the lab updates page, click on the title of a communication to view its details. Each communication contains three tabs providing different ways to view the information. On the default tab, Table of Contents, you will see a listing of all the tests covered in the communication, their effective dates, and the type of communication that they are. New offerings, such as this one, include the most detailed amount of information. To see these details, click on the test name. Here you will find items such as CPT codes, specimen requirements, transport temperature, and interface mapping. Other types of communications, such as test changes, display only information reflecting the change being announced. The changed items will display in bold type. If you would like to print the information for just the particular test that you are viewing, you can do so here. To view details of all the tests covered in a communication at once, click on the Test Details tab. Here you may also see information and announcements that are not displayed within the test-specific details. The View by Category tab allows you to sort based on the type of change. For instance, if you want to reorder this list based on all tests that have a change in interface mapping, simply click the green arrow by the category title. Customizing your view. If there are any items that you do not need to be informed about when changes occur to them and you wish to exclude them from your updates, click here to customize your view while viewing a specific communication. By unchecking an item, it will no longer appear in your on-screen views or in printed or exported materials. These changes are immediately reflected in all of the communications that you have already received and will apply to all future communications. You can always recheck an item and that field will again be included in all updates. Items you have unchecked will be listed here, even when the section is collapsed. These settings are stored by computer rather than account, so if multiple people use the same computer and adjust these settings to accommodate their specific needs, you might want to check this area to ensure that you're receiving all of the information that you need when you log in. To further customize these updates, you can filter by utilization. The account number that you logged in with will be listed here by default. Associated account numbers can be added by separating them with a comma. Clicking Filter allows updates to display only if they relate to tests included in your rolling 12-month test utilization. Regardless of this filter, communications about new tests always display to provide you with the latest test information at your fingertips unless you selected to exclude new tests here. To return to the main unfiltered list, simply click the clear button. Printing and exporting materials. In addition to customizing your view, this section can be used to print or export materials. Click on the Excel icon to open a spreadsheet or the Adobe icon to open a PDF. These materials will display information from the entire communication, but will reflect the customizations that you have made, eliminating any fields that you have elected to remove. This icon will allow you to select your EMR or LIS vendor-specific product and export a spreadsheet that includes content that is relevant to your product as indicated by your vendor. This may facilitate the loading of test updates into your system. So, while selecting Filter by Utilization will eliminate tests that have not been ordered by your account within the past 12 months, this export will not reflect customizations that you have made in this section. If you click on the Lab Updates tab to return to the main list of communications, you will see the same options to print and export materials here. The spreadsheets and PDFs that are generated from these icons will also reflect customizations that you have made, while again, the vendor-specific spreadsheet will not. 
The What's New tab provides you with a simple way to learn about Athena Diagnostics' new test offerings. This list displays all new tests introduced within the past six months. The search section can be utilized to locate new tests that were communicated prior to that six-month range or to search for a specific test. The list also includes the test effective date and a link to the original communication. Click on a specific test to view or print the full details. You can export this list by clicking on the Excel icon at the upper right of the test list. For your convenience, the What's New page also contains a link that will open a new tab or browser taking you directly to the Athena Diagnostics Test Center to access the full test compendium. Helpful instructions for using IntelliTest Manager. The Quick Reference Guide provides brief instructions in a PDF document. For more detailed information about using IntelliTest Manager to best meet your needs, you may replay all or part of this video tutorial by clicking here. This page also displays contact information if you would like to reach out to us for assistance either by phone or email. There is also an option to provide us with feedback by completing a brief survey. The My Account tab is used to manage your account information. The first time you visit this page, you will need to click Create User Account to request a username and password. After receiving your secure credentials, you can log into this page and make updates for your account. If you use an electronic interface, you may select your vendor-specific product here. The benefit to this is that when you use the vendor-specific export option going forward, the selection you made here will default rather than you having to select it every time. If you have associated account numbers, you may add them here, separating each account number with a comma. Again, this will save you some time in the application. In this case, you will not need to list out all of your associated account numbers when filtering by utilization because the account numbers you have added here will already be listed by default. Lastly, you may add email addresses for whomever you would like to receive emails on behalf of your account. These emails will alert you anytime that a new communication is available in IntelliTest Manager for your review and when important updates have been made to the system. If you have any further questions, please use the Contact Us information located on the Support tab. Or if you have any feedback that you'd like to give us, please click Tell Us What You Think. Clicking Log Out will exit you from the application and return you to the login screen. IntelliTest Manager keeps you up to date on changes to the tests that are essential to the care of your patients.